why is it exciting to conduct an auction? Uh, what you want as an auctioneer is to obtain the highest possible price, whether it is for a uh, consignor to a uh, commercial auction or whether it is for a charity. And uh, the task for an auctioneer is exactly the same for a benefit auction because uh, you usually have an organization that needs to raise funds. Uh, for instance, I did an auction last week in uh, Brussels for Human Rights Watch and it is of course very gratifying uh, when you can raise badly needed funds uh, through uh, conducting an auction. Yeah, but the thing is that you are very special. You are just kind of transfiguration when you are with your armor, right? <laughs> well, people say that I'm Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, before it's like and theater. After, before and during an auction. Uh, I'm always petrified before any auction, whether this is a commercial auction or a charity auction. And each time I think to myself, why on earth am I doing this to myself? But then once I'm up there doing the auction, I actually do quite enjoy it. But you, you are like a showman when you are doing the auction, right? What you're trying to do is to make it lively and uh, hopefully entertaining because a lot of people are coming to bid on one lot, some people are just coming to watch, so you don't want to bore your audience. Mm, but uh, how, did you, how did it happen that you make it like a show? Because no one did it before you, right? Like well, that. I've been conducting auctions for a little while. I started <laughs> my first one uh, 45 years ago, so I guess it's like a pilot that uh, you have a lot of flying time, and I guess I have a lot of flying hours in me. Yeah, but who, who teach you to, to fly like that? You know, I always tell young auctioneers, don't try to imitate this person or that person. My only advice to anybody who's starting as an auctioneer is be yourself. Be completely yourself. Uh, try and do what comes naturally. So maybe it comes naturally to me to be theatrical. And um, so, but again, uh, some of the best auctioneers I've witnessed in my career, and I wrote about this in my book, The Auctioneer, uh, have conducted auctions in a very different style. Peter Wilson was so, so quiet when he was conducting an auction that you would hear a pin drop in the auction room, and he was very, very effective, as we all know. Or John Marion at Sotheby's in New York was formidable. Uh, he looked like John Wayne on his saddle in a, in a Western movie and also did that extremely effectively. So, as I say, you can't follow one particular style, just try and be yourself. And yourself is to be Myself a, a is comedian. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. <laughs> Scary.